What up, y'all? What it do? We ain't about to waste no time. We about to get right into it. Well, let me turn this music down. Got the fishes and stuff moving in the background, you know what I mean? It's all good. We got Lexi on the screen. Overnight in the tiniest house. You know, she tiny, so she ain't gonna have a hard time fitting in the house. You know what I'm saying? It's all good. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Make sure y'all subscribe if you're new. You know what I mean? And send me some more videos from Lexi in the comment section below. We're going to tap in. We're going to watch them. We're going to enjoy, all right? All right, let go, y'all. Lexi, overnight in the world's tiniest house. All right, let's get in. I hope she got a refrigerator. Yeah, we like a refrigerator. Bathroom and some food. We good. <laughs> tiniest houses. Why? Because I'm pretty tiny myself and it makes me feel better when other things are tiny too. So I cut what? my bags and drove three hours to my first tiny What? That's called claustrophobic. <laughs> I hate small stuff. I'm big, so I hate small stuff. I get claustrophobic. Even in this room, I feel claustrophobic every day. I have to get outside just to get some fresh air because I feel claustrophobic. Even in the house, I feel claustrophobic. Like I have to get outside. Like it's a requirement every single day or that means I'm having a bad day which never happens <laughs> it never happens you know what I mean because I get outside every day I don't care if it's raining I'm standing in the rain that's my enjoyment I love it I hate small spaces mm. the universe is huge so it's just like wow house. and you probably think this tiny house is going to be really nice <laughs> I packed my bags and drove three hours to my first tiny house. And you no, probably... not the footstep and not the... No. I think this tiny house is going to be really nice. Think again. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. This place is actually really cute. It hey, is nice. It says not to overpack. And uh, I... They got a pool. That's nice. I ain't even got a pool. They got a pool. You know what I mean? I should, I'll take a pool like that. That ain't no real pool. I can see the outside. But I'll, I'll take that, man. Yeah, man. I'll be out there laid out in it. Yep. Mm -hmm. Right in the middle of the sun. I'll take that. Man, I'm gonna get I'm gonna build me a pool. Man, what, what you talking about? I'm gonna build me a pool, y'all. Did the exact opposite. Uh-huh. Throw that water in it. I'm gonna lay so in that thing. Sure. House, house. I think I know why. And they say it's a fun <laughs> adventure for a couple looking to relax and enjoy nature. Well, I'm here by myself, so I just hope I still have fun. To a regular sized okay. person, yeah, this would be a hobbit house, but for me, it's pretty homey. I'm here by myself. I'm alone. Make noise if you wanna be my friend. Ooh. Make another noise if you wanna be my friend. Ooh. <laughs> Let's go look inside our first tiny house. She funny. That's a nice, uh, why is the lock outside? Huh? That didn't make any sense. Why is the lock outside? You, you get locked in there? That means if you go in there and somebody come, they can lock you in there, Lexi. Why is the lock outside the door? Alright, let's go look inside. There's a lock outside the, yeah, I mean, obviously there's probably one inside too. But like I said, they can lock, literally lock you in there. The Hobbit house. And then look at the the top is skinny, but the bottom is wide. <laughs> That's for the women with them big hips. Them them Hobbit women that had them big hips. <laughs> I like I like the structure though. It's it's pretty. It's pretty. It's pretty. Okay. <laughs> Got our first tiny house. Man. All right, let's see y'all. This is like something you'll see at Disney World. Though. I ain't gonna count. She can't even fit in. Anyway, she said not to overpack. Oh my god, you guys. Okay, I knew that this was going to be a small uh, house, but... What the... One more time for Lexi's eyes there. Oh you know what I'm god. saying? One more time for her eyes. They glowing. Oh my god. Okay, I knew that this... Dee. She lost. She got Leo eyes. Them jumps are glowing gold. Forget Hazel. Them jumps are gold like her hair. You see that? And you see how they glow? Like... It look like glass. It don't have no fog in it. You can see it. Dang. That's crazy. This was going to be a small house. That's not camera effects neither. That's crap, crazy. This is miniature. You guys, everything in here is tiny. Here we have our kitchen, the dining room table, and the bathroom. You know, the okay. bathroom is awfully close to the kitchen. It's a little gross. So the owner of this tiny home <clears> actually said not to use the toilet inside the house, but to use the one that's outside. <clears> so we're going to find that at some point. This house is so tiny that they okay. didn't even have room for a bed. So they built it into the wall. Let's try to get in this thing. Hey, that's fine. Get up there. <laughs> Got it. Oh, I deserve a nap after that climb. The shower's outside. I don't think I'm going to be using this because it's pretty cold out here. And that's the only reason why I'm not showering. <laughs> not because I don't normally shower. I'm just kidding. I'm going to use the shower, obviously. For sure. 
the toilet. Now, a fun fact about this toilet, it's actually a compost toilet, meaning it gets rid of the waste for you. All you have to do is do your business, <laughs> which, which I don't do. But once that's done, you put some of this inside the toilet, mix okay. it around a little bit, and then gone. Now, where exactly does it go? I... Uh. So we've seen pretty much everything the house has to offer, but on the listing it says that there's some horses on property, so, you know, the tiny house is actually on over an acre of land, so it might be kind of hard to find the horses. Hopefully we can find them. I found the horses! <laughs> That's what I thought. I think this is what the <laughs> The goats, yeah. The Capricorns, yeah. <laughs> You scared? Ooh, on the horses. Look at the tiny little horse. Look at the cute little horse. Look at the little horse. No, it's just me and you, buddy. It's just me and you. I found something. So this is a treasure chest. It's just laying on the side of the house. And you know what's inside treasure chests? Normally something pretty cool. That's a. Uh, uh, that's not open. All right, we're just gonna use my foot instead. Not on the land. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's only treasure chests in the ocean. Not on the land. That's because they was trying to travel bringing gold from one place to the next which they don't do now because people broke but you're not gonna find what you gonna find in the treasure chest on land <laughs> nothing <It>, obviously <laughs> that's like going to the moon and be like yo i found a treasure chest what you think you're gonna find in there nothing <laughs> You ain't gonna find nothing. Like somebody already took it out. Trust me. <laughs> People don't leave nothing unturned. Trust me. See, I told you guys normally inside is something pretty cool. <laughs> nothing. I need more friends. It also comes with a jacuzzi that's pretty much bigger than the actual house. See, the jacuzzi look nice. Nonetheless, what do you say we take a dip? Yeah, that's get in there. It's cold. <gasps> I know it. Not a jacuzzi. I know it. So I just got word from the listing that the jacuzzi is not a jacuzzi. Um, it's actually something called a cowboy pool, and it's used for cold plunges. <laughs> so, the sun's coming down. Okay, cold plunges. I like that. Okay. Okay. Instead of ice bath. Uh, yeah, I like that. Cold plunges. Okay, I got you. <laughs> it's getting colder, but look at this view. Wow. That's beautiful. You know, it makes me want to run around like I'm in an indie film. That is beautiful, though. Lexi, you should have just took Pearson with you. Like, this is crazy. This is this is crazy. You should have took Pearson with you. Like, this is crazy. Why he, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Why there's so many people you could have took. Why you didn't take anybody? <laughs> she could have took the whole world with her. She here talking about she ain't got no friends. She funny, bruh. Everybody want to be your friend. So is that you don't have friends or you just don't accept people being your friend? Your, your standards are a little bit too high. Is that what's going on? Because that doesn't make any sense, Lexi. You have plenty of friends. I'm pretty sure. And I'm pretty sure it's millions of people who want to be your friend. You know what I'm saying? But if your standards are too high, you're going to be without friends until you're about 60 years old. You finally gonna get older, and you gonna be like your mama, and you finally gonna be like, hey, I guess I can make a couple new friends. That's <laughs> like, you could have been did that. Like, be a kid, bro. Make friends, have fun. That's what life is about. You know what I'm saying? Like, what? <laughs> I'm I'm mad she didn't bring nobody with her. She could have brought Pearson. She could have took Ben. Man, she could have took to Jeremy. You know what I mean, man? What? She could have took live with her. Even could have took Brent. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, she could have took me. <laughs> but she ain't got no friends. She could have took one of y'all supporters. You know what I'm saying? She could have took one of y'all. She could. She don't never do that. Y'all notice that? Why she don't never do that? Why she don't never take y'all on no trips? Huh? Hmm. Okay. To each his own. <laughs> but as the day comes to a close, we can't forget about dinner. So since I'm in a tiny house, I thought it was only fitting to bring tiny food. <laughs> now I'm gonna starve out here. Anyways, I have all the. You ain't cooking. I, ain't even, I don't even know why you're saying that. Not just brings all the boys to the yard. They're like, mm, sorry. <laughs> I got it open. Well, let's make a tiny milkshake. Come on. Actually, you need to stay right there. 
Oh my god, a mini chocolate bar. These are like those little like bras that are like wafers but chocolate. Yeah, okay. we're getting excited. The instructions literally say not edible. Apparently, you're not supposed to eat this. So the whole joke about me starving out here was a joke at first and now it's not. But, oh well, I think it's bedtime. You guys, it was so much easier to get onto the bed this time. And I'm not still out of breath from getting onto the bed. I'm out of breath because of the altitude here. We're like in the mountains and stuff. Anyway, okay. it's been a long, lonely day. And it's only going to get lonelier. So uh, I think it's time to get some rest. And I will see you guys in the morning. It's literally 6 in the morning. And it's time to get to our next tiny home. I must say right now it's 4 in the morning. For me. <laughs> it's 4.30, y'all. Literally. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> we gotta get Lexi to jail, bro. What is going on? Oh, so I crawled out of bed and flew all the way to New Mexico for the next tiny house. I'm here. I haven't seen anyone oh. in like three days. This tiny house is literally in the middle of the desert. So I've actually been to the world's largest glass house, and now I'm at the world's smallest. I swear I don't have a weird obsession with glass houses. Listing says You're lying. I know you're lying. <laughs> because I do. So I know you're lying. I know all humans would love a glass house if they could have one. Especially if it, it can take the, the weather. You know what I mean? They can see the sunshine through the stars at night. Trust me, you're lying. Everybody wish they had a glass house. Shut up. <laughs> Why do people lie? I have no idea. Like, I just don't understand. I'm gonna start calling it out. Every single time somebody lies, I'm like, you're lying. You're lying. <laughs> I'm just gonna call it out because it's just ridiculous now. It don't make no sense. Five acre lot property in New Mexico. Okay. Endless views. All to yourself. All I'm saying okay. is dirt. Perfect <laughs> location to be off the grid without being off the grid. Well, I, I don't have any cell service and the nearest town is probably 20 minutes away. If anyone wants to kill me, now would be the time to do so. I, I don't want you to, I'm just saying now would be a pretty good time. Uh, right, let's check it out. Chill out. <laughs> Why? Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who should everyone subscribe to? Me. You. And I'm looking at her. <laughs> Apparently, all she's worse than Pearson. <laughs> By herself, she's worse than Pearson. Oh my gosh, Pearson's actually funny. She's worse than Pearson. This is this is horrible. This is insane. What you need is this key card. So let's try this. Oh, open sesame. What? So anybody can go there and just beep? Hey, really I'm anyone just can do that. Right. Oh I guess she thought the same thing I thought. Yeah. You guys are not going to believe how crazy this place is. We have a couch, a chair, another chair, a bed. Uh -huh. And that's it. I know. That's it. Well, yeah. You don't want to use the bathroom in there. It's going, it ain't no ventilation. You don't want to cook in there. It ain't no ventilation. But I do see why they say that. <laughs> Endless views. It don't matter which way you look, you gonna get some views. Okay. Where's the bathroom? <laughs> going to tiny houses but i didn't think they were going to be this tiny now i know how everyone feels when they see me for the first time because i like to lie about my height you know i say i'm a solid you know five three to five five i'm gonna be completely honest right here right now i'm five foot <laughs> you five foot you small i mean we can see that right now but i wouldn't have not get i would not have guessed that mm -hmm. i have not guessed that okay <laughs> What? You like a kid, literally. <laughs> and then she got oversized clothes on. That don't help at all. <laughs> it's like, did your, did your, uh, did your older sister give you those clothes? <laughs> it's like it just don't help at all. It's like, okay, where did you get these? This uh, thrift from? The thrift store. <laughs> I'm pretty but, sure if you look up my height, it says five foot one, and it's a lie. But they wow. don't lie about how tiny these houses were. One thing about this tiny home is the view actually is endless. Well, all of these homes are in very remote places, and I have no cell service to actually order anything, but luckily, I came prepared. Okay. Let me show you what, what you we got? have in here. We have a cook set, propane, a lantern, mini spoons, mini forks, top ramen, my PJs, and a lighter. So basically, I have everything I need. <laughs> She's a demon. <laughs> I found me. Lexi, you're not slick. You're not fooling me at all. She's a demon. Nah, no, just playing. She don't eat meat, so that's good. I don't know how you eat ramen noodles 
Anytime I eat noodles, that junk come right up my booty. So I don't know how she eating that. She gonna have to use the bathroom. I'm telling you that right now. I don't know how she eating that. Amenities. Let's see what this house has to offer. So here oh, we have man. the shower. Literally out in the open. Naked and afraid. Am I right? Oh, wait. Does water come out of here as well? Okay, I spoke too soon. I think the shower might be pretty cool. It's broken. But hey, it's not Aww. so bad. We have a jacuzzi that has no water in it. But it does come with this cute little bonfire situation. And three extra chairs. If anyone wants to join me. <laughs> anyone? Literally anyone. <laughs> As I made a treacherous journey into the unknown land of the desert, my only worry is that I would get lost on my way back. Yep, I'm definitely lost. I am getting a little bit worried. I don't really know which way to go, and obviously I don't have a lot of food or water out here. So, whew, never been in this. Lexi, there's a whole power line. You're not lost. There's a power line. We can see it from right here. <laughs> If you're in the desert, there won't be power lines. That's, that means you're lost. There's a whole power line, which means there's a street right over here. And I see a building right here. You're not lost. Be quiet. I told you, you can't fool us. It's 2024. We're going to have to start calling this stuff out, y'all. We can't We can't allow people to sit here and try to fool us, bro. We can't allow people to be stupid. You know what I'm saying? We're not allowing that to happen no more. That's the reason why most people are like, oh, I don't like doing YouTube. It's all fake. It's not all fake. It's just some of the stuff is fake. <laughs> Obviously, right? Conditions before. There's about two hours before the sun goes down, so that's how much time I have to find my tiny house before something out here finds me. <laughs> I really hope there's nothing out here. Oh, sh <laughs> Okay, you guys, it is getting dark, and I'm just now getting back to my dome. I think it's time to go inside, make some dinner, and then go to sleep. And I forgot there are no lights in here. Oh, wow. This lantern would come in handy. Like I said, you guys, there are no lights in here, so it's pitch black without this on. And it's also freezing, so I'm going to make some soup to warm myself up. Along with my tiny home, I have a tiny stove. And we're going to make some ramen. Hopefully this will warm me up for the night. I'm drop it in here. And it's time to use my mini forks. Look at how cute these little forks are. Are you kidding? Now we're going to add some seasoning. It probably wasn't the smartest idea for me to buy mini forks. I'm, like, burning my hand every time I try to stir this. <laughs> I didn't bring any bowls or plates or anything, so... So right. this will have to do. Okay. I'm not gonna lie to you. This is really, really good. Like okay. this is gourmet. All right, I'm gonna finish my dinner and then we're gonna go to bed. All right, you guys, it's literally so cold in here. And honestly, I'm just trying to make it through the night. So as I began to settle in for the night, I couldn't help but feel isolated from the rest of the world and I could barely sleep. You guys, it is literally 3 a.m. and I cannot sleep because I'm so cold. I have three blankets on me and it's just not enough. I'm gonna try to get some sleep. All that I have to do is make it through tonight. So hopefully the next time I see you guys, it will- she cold, cold. She got three blankets on. That is crazy. I literally have the windows open, y'all. <laughs> like, it's hot. Like, I can't even explain it. Like, even when it's 20 degrees outside, I'm sweating. So when it's 40, oh, I'm drenched. My shirt is done for. When it's 60, it's, it's burning up. I literally got to walk around with no shirt on. When it's 80, oh, man, I'm about to take my pants off at that point. It's hot. And the thing about it is, I didn't start getting this hot until I put God first. As soon as I start putting God first, I started heating up. Like hot. I show you my arms now. You can be like, you dripping. Yeah. It's hot. My hands clammy right now. It's hot. So I don't get how people be so cold. Unless they cold hearted. Because when you cold hearted and you don't really show love to the world around you not just your family and friends i'm talking about to the entire world around you 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 begin to feel cold on the inside lexi you need to start showing more love to people bro for sure there's no way you should be cold there's no way you should be cold it doesn't even make sense you and your team got too much motion going on there's no way you can go cold there's no way Unless there's some other stuff going on, which is spiritual, but I ain't going to get too deep into that with her. All right, let's keep the video going for the kids. You feel me? I ain't going to say too much. It will be, uh, uh, we did it. I wish I, I was cold. Like, after the night I, just had. I wish. We still have another tiny house to go see, so I think we have to head out. And hopefully this next one has a bathroom, because I haven't gone, or have I? <laughs> let's just say the jacuzzi is now filled. <laughs> I'm kidding. That's disgusting. Yeah. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. She she got no type of balance, man. Put get her in the gym, y'all. She ain't got no balance or nothing, man. She just it's just like <laughs> it's like a chicken with his head cut off for real. Oh, the next tiny house was also out in the <laughs> desert, and let's just say this one was pretty cool. Okay. Oh, we made it. I'm at a literal castle, like a tiny castle. Nonetheless, oh. it is a castle for sure, yeah. I'm really excited like to go castle. inside and see what it looks like, and this place comes with a bunch of cool stuff, so I just want to get started. Let's go see the castle. Wow. So, like the castles. whole thing is shaped like a circle. This Ooh. tiny home actually comes with Wi-Fi, thank goodness, because with the other tiny homes, I haven't had any cell service, and it's honestly a little scary, but this one has Wi-Fi. <laughs> Room service. Okay, we'll be using I that guess later. I must be we got too. A mini fridge. Are you Ooh, kidding okay. me? Here we have some strawberry lemonade. There's alcohol in that. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say I wouldn't drink that if I was you. Not only is alcohol, it's metal in it. You see, it's in a metal tin can. It's metal in there. That means you just drunk alcohol, and metal, and a mixture of juice. Like, why are you poisoning yourself on stream? Like, why am I watching this? Like, why'd you just drink that? Doesn't even make sense. That's why I be talking about that monkey stuff, bro. <laughs> it doesn't even make sense. Why you just sat there and drunk that? It literally makes zero sense. Now, my biggest struggle throughout the entire video was getting my giant suitcase into these tiny houses. And uh, we have a really small, narrow staircase here. So let's try to get this bad boy up there. That's beautiful. All right, we're one step down. I told you I get in the gym. I told you. Oh, no, we can't trust her with the baby. Uh-uh. <laughs> oh, no. You can't trust she is she is the baby. <laughs> we can't trust her with no baby. She is the baby. <laughs> you know, she only five foot. She ain't man, no man, no man. No man, she still got some growing to do. Mm-hmm. Know what I said, I'm already knowing. I can just tell how she act. She got some growing to do. Mm-hmm. Tell my she ain't got no friends. I see why. I see why. I can tell. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can see why. <laughs> I'm considering purchasing a tiny home. Like, these are so practical. Oh, that's I, mean, far. I don't know what this is, but it looks insane. Where does this lead to? Oh. We're gonna find out. So, it seems like in every tiny house that we've been to, I've had to climb something. So, uh. Come on, Lexi. You this. got this. Open sesame! <laughs> well, I've done just about all I can do. Open okay, it. It's to the roof. Has a rooftop. Yeah, it's to the roof. This tiny house isn't so tiny. Okay, this entire thing is like my campground. And the people that deliver the room service, I'm pretty sure they live in there. Oh, that's or fine. maybe in those little huts. <laughs> literally on top of a mini castle. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair! <laughs> <laughs> I should have brought friends. So this tiny home comes with one thing that the other tiny homes did not have, and that's room service. I just scanned the QR code, and you guys, there's food on here. There's an option to go into a sauna, and they have a that bunch of fun. other really cool things to do. So I'm going to place an order for food and for a couple of activities. You guys, my room service is on its way. Right. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. It's like Ooh, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, looking good. Ooh, where did I get this from? That right there look good. I'm not gonna lie, I want one of them. That look good. And the green juice. The, I mean, who is them grapes? Did somebody sit here and chop the grapes up? That means you touched on every single last one of them, and then she gonna put it in her mouth. I don't see no gloves on your hands. Ew. See, I don't like people preparing stuff for me. Uh, -uh that ain't gonna work. <laughs> that ain't gonna work. Uh, uh, uh. -uh. I bet the seat is gloves still on your hands. Uh uh, that ain't gonna work. Mm -hmm. So good. All right, I got fruit and yogurt, a okay. seven up, and a matcha latte from room service. I can't even believe this place has room service, so we're gonna give it a try. Try my matcha latte. Okay. That's really good. So matcha seven latte. up. Seven up. And I'm gonna try a piece of fruit. She got it. Seven up in the glass. No more metal, no more plastic, y'all. Mm hmm. She got it. Okay. That is so good. They also the, pizza. the guy delivered this on a tricycle, so it has to be good. Cheers. <laughs> mm -hmm. This is my first real meal in three days. I think it's safe to say that we saved the best tiny house for last. Yes. Luckily for me, this place comes with a sauna because it's literally 50 degrees oh. outside. And it says reserved on the door. Who do you think that's reserved for? I'll give you a hint. 
There's nobody else here. All right, you guys, I just got into the sauna and it literally feels so nice in here. Technically, this is a wood burning sauna, so let me show you how it works. So you take some of this water and then you pour it over these rocks and it ignites the fire. Hey. It's even hotter in here. That's fire. Okay. Let's see what else they have. This place also comes with a mini pool, which I will not be using because it's a little dirty. All of oh. these tiny homes have outdoor showers and I'm not complaining and neither are my neighbors. I'm just kidding. I, I'm sure if they saw that, they'd be like, my eyes. Now, the last shower didn't work, so let's see if this one does. Okay. Yep. Works. Since we're out of time, this is the best one I've seen. Fire. That's why it's such a small fire. Not because I don't know how to start one. So you can get marshmallow kits for two, but uh, there's only one of me, so I'm going to be eating for two. And as I was enjoying my s'mores, the owner of the Airbnb sent me a chilling message. Oh. And the owner sent me a list of house rules. So she says, be sure to not put the thermostat over 76 degrees. Make sure you put the fire out before going inside. Be sure to close all doors and windows because we have coyotes, scorpions. <laughs> <laughs> she got up out of there real quick uh, I'm pretty sure the glass house one she was at had the same stuff I'm pretty she was in the desert so you gotta have wild dogs coyotes and it gotta be scorpions and snakes in the desert you gotta be reptiles it has to be lizards and all it has to be you know what I mean it's the desert that's where they live that's where they reside you feel me she funny though <laughs> Biggest fan of critters. <laughs> she got that thing so quick. She said she got coyotes, scorpions, and critters. She was like, no. Close all doors and windows because we have coyotes, scorpions. She seen critters. She like, no. no. I'm not the biggest fan of critters. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that was a good video. I ain't gonna lie. That was a good video. Um, my favorite tiny home was the last one for sure. Because it had all the amenities. <laughs> and the amenities worked. They had the room service. You know what I'm saying? You get whatever food you want. That is perfect. I would be sitting there reading books all day. Enjoying the spa and the sunlight. While getting whatever food I want. That sounds delicious, right? Exactly. The last one was the best one. Ah, that was funny, though. Thanks for the video, Lexi. Next time you should bring your friends because you have a lot of them. See y'all. Peace.